We're all seeing trauma as a factor in impeding many of our patients' healing. As a response, I'm offering this four-day course on applying the sinew channels and the low vessels for the resolution of physical and emotional trauma. This is a four-day course. You don't have to have any previous background in the study of the channel systems or the sinew and low in particular. So I'm going to take you from the very foundations of the sinew and low theory and build it all the way up to specifically addressing trauma. You'll get the basis of these channels and therefore we'll be able to use them for applications to many other conditions as well. We're going to take this all the way through so you can see them with live cases, get some hands-on practice, learn the needling techniques and the bleeding techniques. We're also going to spend a full day learning and practicing the sinew releases, which is something which is rarely demonstrated. Why don't we focus on the sinews and the lows? Well, the sinew channels really shape and reveal our unconscious stance towards the world. Postures and Wei Qi responses and distortions are sculpted by trauma. The sinew channels can resolve holdings and blockages in our body caused by trauma and help to restore the free flow of our Wei Qi. They can return a natural freedom of movement so patients can reconnect to the outer world with more ease. The low channels are crucial for releasing trauma, regardless of whether that trauma is recent or latent. Low channels are conduits of blood and thereby of Shen, so they have this very direct effect on the emotions and on our consciousness, on our self-awareness. Learning to treat the low vessels opens up many possibilities for your patient's emotional health. The lows can re-regulate emotionally and, and hand a person back their potency following a trauma. The lows are really key for facilitating access to our inner world. So I look forward to meeting you in Australia, where we'll cover the basic theory of sinew channels and low vessels and extend those teachings all the way to this crucial focus on the treatment of emotional and physical trauma.